Hey, you guys again. Uh, it's me, my Sheila, aka Michael, aka Scooby. <clears throat> that could trust me. Uh, I'm doing a Blu ray movie review now. Uh, that ain't what I have right now. Let me tell you something. When I was living with my parents, me and my dad together had movies like up the ass. So, what I have here is movies that I bought out of my money. Movies that he has, he's got, honestly, he's got approximately in Blu-ray, he's got like a couple hundred. Uh, in DVD format, he has like 500 type shit. I'm being honest right here. Um, Game-wise, he has probably like close to like probably 50. I don't know, I'm not sure exactly. But, so yeah, what I have here is movies I bought out of my money. So here we go. Big fan of The Mummy. The Mummy, The Mummy, The Mummy. It's a real good fucking movie. Uh, I really don't know what to say about it. It's just real good. I mean, I'm into that horror type shit, you know. Kind of an adventure. Friday. Had to get it. Had to buy it. You have to love it. These motherfuckers are funny. These niggas are funny. Friday is a real good comedy movie. You guys should take a look at it if you haven't watched it. If you haven't watched it, I think you're just stupidest motherfuckers out there. This movie, really, everybody has had to watch, okay? You wanna hear what I'm saying? You know what I'm hearing, I'm saying? We got Smokey, you know what I'm saying? They smoke weed, you know, the good shit, you know? Menace to Society. This game, I mean this game, this movie is awesome. If you haven't watched this, you might as well fucking watch it. Let you know how it was back then. Racism and shit. But these kids right here brought it to a top level where... You just be like, oh my god, I can't believe he fucking did this and that, you know. It's a real good fucking movie. Dawn of the Dead, had to get it. I love zombie movies. I love this movie. Uh, I think, well, I love it. For my taste, I love it. You know, everybody has their own taste. So I do love the movie. Uh, yeah. The Perfect Getaway. This is actually my dad's movie, but I got it because I like the movie more than he does. It's a real good fucking movie. Uh, nice adventure, thriller, you know, get you thinking, like, what the fuck, who is this, who that, who is it, who, uh, you know, when did this happen, real good movie, if you haven't watched it, you should watch it, recommend it, Charlie's Angel, it's my girl's movie, I haven't, I don't know, I haven't, I haven't watched Charlie's Angel, if it's good, let me know, I've never sat down and watched it, but I can watch it now, because I got no fucking PS3, so hopefully when I get paid, I get a, a, a Blu-ray player, yeah, Chevy Chase is Fletch. Fletch. It's a good comedy movie. I bought it because this is comedy, and I love comedy. Let me tell you something. I love comedy. I love horror. I love thrillers. And I don't know whatever that is. But yeah, um, it's a real good movie. It's pretty old though, but it's good. Oh, get the fuck out of here! My shit's fucking broken. Oh yeah, I remember. Final Destination, the Final Destination. Love it. Love this movie. This movie is awesome. I uh, I wish they had it in 3D though. But I think Terminator 1988, if I'm correct, was EU that said it comes with glasses. If it do, then that means it sucks, then huh? Let me know what you think about the 3D in a review, so I know exactly. But you know, I got the regular Blu-ray format. Love it. I love the saga. A lot of people hate it, but I love it no matter what. I love that gory type shit. I don't know why, but I do. The Hangover, unrated. Oh, man. Movie. Hilarious. Fucking hilarious. If you haven't watched this shit, you're just missing out because it's fucking hilarious. You just laugh your ass off with these motherfuckers. Hangover Part 2. Gotta have it since I have Part 1. I bought Part 2, and it's better. I think it's better than the first one. Let me know what y'all think about these movies. I mean, I think it's better than the first one. But, uh, yeah. I love the little monkey. It's so funny. Pride and Glory. This movie is fucking awesome. Truth, honor, loyalty, family. What are you willing to sacrifice? This movie is awesome. Pride and Glory. Take it up, please. Good cop, bad cop routine type shit. That's all I'm saying. Ramona and Beezus. Uh, I got it because my dad and my mom said it was good, and you know, they're into that family type stuff. So my girl wanted to get it, so I got it. Uh, 
I think I've seen half of it. I didn't see much of it. From what I seen, it was pretty good. She's got a good imagination. Uh, it's good for you, Grizz. You got a little brother, little sisters, and a family that likes to watch family movies together. Highly recommendable. You know, it's good for you guys to sit and watch. Dun, dun, dun. Final Destination 5. Oh, man. This I would love to have in 3D, but regular 3D, not no come with glasses and put them on and shit. I don't want to have this movie in 3D because this movie is awesome. I loved it. I went to the theaters when it came out. Loved 3D like it got me. I actually had to walk home that night, and it was a far walk. I was pissing my pants because I was scared of crossing streets. I was me and my brother, we, well, me and my ex guy. We don't get along no more, but me and my guy, ex guy, uh, used to like just walk, look at each other, dude. Is everything gonna be okay? I mean, it has you, it has you paranoid coming out the theater like, oh my god, anything could fucking happen. The Lion King remake. Had to get it. True fan of it. Love it when I was a kid. Love it now. No matter how old I get, I'll still love it. And I love when they bring out the color. I mean, it just looks amazing. Yeah. Ah. Rocky. The com the Undisputed Collection. So I got one, two, three, four, five, and the last one, you know, six. Rocky Balboa. Ah. Uh, my girl actually got it for me. You know, she bought it for me because uh, ever and ever Rocky goes on, comes on TNT, TBS, whatever. I watch it no matter what. Movie makes me cry. I'm very, I got a good warm heart. Uh, you know, it's a, it's a good movie. I love boxing movies, and when I got this collection, I told my girl I love you so much, you know, and I do. And she made my day when I got this, and I sat down every day. It was each day when I first got it. I saw part one. Then the next episode, part two. Then the next episode, I have to watch this episode, you know. Every day, I watch one of the movies. Um, yeah. That's, I mean, you know, it's a good fuck. It's, it's fucking good. If you don't like Rocky, I don't know why, but this is awesome. And still, I'm a huge Sylvester Stallone fan. Uh, I got here The Walking Dead, season one. Love it. I love it, you know, because I love zombie movies, you know. It's fucking good. Um, three disc, you know. Real good. I don't know if you haven't seen the series, but I think it's on Netflix. If you don't got Netflix, then I don't know. But yeah, they got actually you know little life size uh uh I don't know if I can see it you know, action figures and stuff. Yeah. And it actually comes with a card, a uh, playing card, a collectible card, whatever. I don't know. It's a real good collection. You know, I, I can't wait to get season two. I'm really I haven't seen season two on TV because since I work third shift. I don't get, I don't have a chance to watch it. Uh, I started off my 3D collection with Transformers: Dark of the Moon. I didn't get to witness it because my P3, my PS3 fucked up, so I can't watch it. Well, I watched the 2D version, but love Transformers. Uh, this actually took it to a whole different level with people dying and getting sucked into whatever, but disappearing and shit. Uh, but I love the physical, and it took place here in Milwaukee. I seen the place where it took place, and it was pretty good. Fast Five, have to have it, have to get it. Intense cars, action, and shit. I mean, this thing blows your mind with the fast-paced action. I'm I'm trying to get one, two, and three, and the rest, you know, to add to the collection. Gran Torino is the shit, all right? This motherfucker, Clint Eastwood knows how to direct, act, and everything else. Good movie, pick it up. I got here three movies in one. I have Twister, Poseidon, and The Perfect Storm. Great fucking movies. All three of them are great. Nothing really I can't much say about it, but it's great. If you don't like these movies, I don't know why, but pick it up, rent it, whatever. These movies are fucking awesome. Uh, Lady and the Tramp. I picked it up because this is a diamond edition. I don't want them going back into storage and we're having to wait a couple more years to have them. Um, when I was a kid, I did love it. Uh, I love it now too, but I pretty much want to collect all these because... I want them to have one when my daughter gets older. You know, right now she's eight months. She's turning eight months on the 23rd. So, um, when she gets older, so she knows what I used to watch and stuff. And it's all high def now, so she can understand everything, whatever. Uh, it's a really good cartoon, though. Beavis and Butthead. Boy, 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 you gonna score. Beavis gonna score. This, oh, I think he's gonna score. This motherfucker is a fucking awesome. Volume 4, the latest ones that came out on MTV. Have to have it. If you guys don't have this, I don't know. I mean, these motherfuckers are, like, so cool, you know? <laughs> and, uh, yeah. You gotta have the movie. You gotta have that collection, man. Uh, Resident Evil Afterlife 3D. 
I love every fucking Resident Evil. The only one I really don't like that much is Part One because it didn't have to take a lot with zombies. It was more of the fucking virus outbreak, so it didn't have to do a lot with zombies. But the saga continues and it's awesome. I can't wait actually to the new one. And if you don't know, there is a new Resident Evil coming out soon. So, oh, well, not not soon, but at least look it up. I'm not sure exactly the name of it, but check it out. You guys uh, will be amazed what you see. In time, in fucking time, Justin Timberlake. I like him okay as a singer, rap, whatever, you know, he's okay, but in time, seeing him now as an actor is fucking awesome. Boy, he knows how to act, and this movie is great. I loved it. Ugh. My guy loved it. I don't know if my girl seen it yet, I'm not sure, but real good movie. If y'all don't think about it, then, you know, rest it, whatever, but it's awesome, you know. And I'm actually thinking of myself getting a tattoo with numbers on my arm, and uh, I'll probably have that where it could, like, Go on the dark type shit. You guys should get that tattooed. Um, but yeah, it's a uh, excuse me. It's a uh, it's a real fucking good movie. That's all I got right now. You know, right here. Uh, I won't. I will not. Uh, I would like to show you my 360 games. I really wouldn't either. I mean, I only got a couple. You know, it's, I got probably like four or five type shit. Yeah. Six. I really, I really can't uh, say much about it, but. Uh, so I'll probably hold off on the 360 collection. Y'all take it easy, y'all, and let me know what y'all think. Give me uh, in the comments and stuff, man. Hug me up over here. I uh, love y'all. Terminator 1988. Hey, man, take it easy. More videos, bro. Game shot, uh, uh, game shot thing person. I forgot. To say. I gotta look it up and shit. Hey, man, just uh, hook it up and shit. And yeah, I, I won't pick up that cartel shit, because if it sucks, it sucks, man. Thank you a lot for that.